gentlemen. Hope you're doing well today. I have a um, another cigar review that I'm wanting to do, and today it's it's a bit of a funky cigar, a Dominican cigar that has the most bizarre uh, wrapper that's on it. And let me see if I can get that in there. That is a. A Heisman stance, Heisman block there. This is the Ron Mexico cigar, and it is curious to find out where that idea came in. But this is a cigar that we're going to try today. Um, it has a very good earthy flavor. Very um, uh, nothing, nothing to note specifically about this and let's uh let's give this a shot Well, as I get into this cigar, I want to, I just want to let you know that I am very grateful that you guys uh, come around watch my videos. Uh, I would, I would love for you to like, comment, subscribe, and uh, let me know if you've had this particular cigar, the wrong, the Ron Mexico cigar from the, uh, it's a Dominican cigar. Well, <clears throat> that tag is going to be the closest thing to a, a, a trophy or an award that it is ever going to see. It's a very, very mild cigar. Extremely mild, in fact. And I have to say, um, there's just not much to it. It's an unremarkable <laughs> cigar. However, I will say, there's not a real, it's, there's not a bad taste to it at all. Um, uh, if you want a very cheap cigar that you want to just keep lit all the time, this is not a bad option. It's burning very evenly, as you can see, which I took a little time making sure that I began the burn well. However, um, I do that on all my cigars. I like, to, I like to give it the best chance that I can, that I have, uh, that I can to give it an even burn. It draws nice. Um, they they rolled it well. After a moment, there does settle a, a, a very stale cigar taste on your tongue, but it's not it's not overt. It there I mean there's definitely the cigar taste, but it's not it's it's not overt. It, there's some that don't do that that I've had recently in this pack of samplers that I'm slowly going through, but the front end is not bad at all. There is just again unremarkable. Um, I've been I've run into a batch of cigars that have not been rolled well and have been uh, tough on the draw and have not burned evenly. I can at least say. That this is it. If you're wanting a cigar that you can keep lit all day long, that doesn't smell 
too bad. Uh, I will write down in the uh, description whether or not my wife uh, thought so, but I'm not detecting any of the of the punging, pungentness that my wife usually dislikes um, and is not a bad flavor of a cigar. Uh, it might be bland and unremarkable, but you, if you want to keep a cigar lit, this isn't a bad one to uh, bring to the table. I will say that we're already starting to get a breakdown of the ash, which I would expect it to last quite a bit longer, but uh, that could be that um, it, that just shows that it's not a high quality uh, roll, even if they rolled it loose enough to get a good draw on it. So. What have you guys been smoking? I'd love to hear what you are uh, smoking, what it is that you're enjoying right now. Have you tried the Ron Mexico cigar with the little guy in the was a Serape that's uh, doing the Heisman stance while smoking a cigar? It's really a, a bizarre, bizarre wrapper on it. Anyway, uh, love to hear from you. Like, comment, and subscribe. I would be eternally grateful. And uh, until next time, have a good day, gentlemen.